Hey everyone, my name is Brian and I'm the 3D Print Creator and in this episode I want to talk to you about uh, a real nice material that I've been printing with uh, yeah, just for, for a few prints uh, and uh, it, it's a flexible material, it's the Colorfab Engine Flex. I'm going to show you the site uh, real quick uh, because this is the, the Engine Flex material and uh, I bought some uh, sample uh, material of that Engine Flex black and uh, so they have four colors and as you can see here uh, Engine Flex uh, well you have to print it with 240 to 260 degrees Celsius and uh, the advised printing speed is 40 to 60 millimeters a second and you have to print on Biltec with an 80 degrees uh, hotbed. Now what the fun thing is, is that I have a lot of printers here and uh, all of them are Bowden tube printers, so they all have a Bowden extruder. And uh, well, the thing if you work with a Bowden extruder is that it's pretty difficult to print with a flexible material. Now I've tried it on the Creality CR10, it can print a little bit flexible, uh, you have to print very slow, uh, but the extruder is not perfect for it. Uh, I've tried it also on the uh, Anycubic i3 Mega for example, a complete disaster, didn't print uh, TPU that nice. And uh, I've been printing on, on uh, some other printers as well with flexible, and it, well, it, it worked, but it, it wasn't perfect. Until I got the Ender 2 machine. Was, with the Ender 2 machine uh, it, it really works flawless. <coughs> it has a very short uh, Bowden tube, uh, so the, the PTFE tube is very short. And uh, well, th that's a big advantage because, because of its shortness uh, you're able to have retraction. And with Engine Flex this material is flexible but it, it's stiff enough to have that retraction work. So it works way better than for example with TPU. Now I've been printing uh, this face and uh, as you've seen on, on the video it, it really turned out very very nice. Um, it's very smooth, uh, it, it's f you can't see the, the, the lines on it but it's squishy as can be so it, it really yeah, it, it's a great material and uh, well I have to say I'm really convinced that the engine flex material is a material that we can use more and more for flexible printing and I think also that the Ender 2 printer is a great printer for this type of prints. So if you are willing to try uh, flexible materials there is no affiliate link or associate between me and Colorfab whatsoever. Uh, it's just Colorfab is the only company that makes the engine flex uh, material. I had to pay for the sample pack so uh, there is no link between them and me. Uh, but if you want to try flexible material and you want to make sure that you have a material that is really worth trying it because it works on your Bowden printer. well. Engine Flex is the answer. So if you like this then please like uh, uh, on the like button downstairs, uh, down below. Also subscribe to my channel and uh, well <laughs> hit that bell button as well because otherwise you won't be notified every time I make a new video. And well basically this is it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.